Here's your Storm Track 7 forecast. Good Friday morning. I'm Storm Track 7 meteorologist Brandon Libby. The cold front has pushed out all the rain and storms this morning and the clouds are going to exit as well. So we'll end up with plenty of sunshine for today. Looking like an absolutely beautiful one too. Uh, as we go throughout tonight though, a warm front is going to be approaching and then eventually moving by. And that's going to give you maybe some clouds out there. We'll call it mostly clear to partly cloudy, not coming with any rain here for tonight. We're in between the warm front and cold front tomorrow. It's going to be a lot of sunshine, but also some strong south winds and really warm, if not hot temperatures on the way, which we'll talk about here in a second. And then the cold front will come through for tomorrow evening. That'll give you a couple more clouds and maybe a chance for an isolated shower or storm roughly between El Cater and Decorah. So basically that northeastern corner of the viewing area. Pretty low chance at it, honestly, and uh, it's a very small window for it. The clouds will decrease throughout tomorrow night, and then it's more sunshine for the day on Sunday. Here's a look at the weekend forecast with the strong south winds, which will gust to 40 miles per hour tomorrow. High temperatures get back into the upper 80s. Slight chance for those storms in the northeast, and then by Sunday, it's more of a northwest wind. Highs are down to the low 70s, so a wild swing in temperatures throughout the weekend. Also, an extremely high fire danger for Saturday, so Please avoid any burning outdoors and just be very, very careful uh, as you're out in the fields this weekend. If you're going to be out there, uh, it's still very dry, very low relative humidity and fires will spread very easily with the winds being so strong. Again, near record high temperatures too on Saturday. Mid to upper 80s is the forecast. Records are about the upper 80s to low 90s. We might even set a new one there in Iowa City. So it is not going to be feeling like October tomorrow. More like October today, highs are in the low to mid 70s with the sunny skies and an east wind at 5 to 15 miles per hour. And for tonight, not going to be as cold. We're going to be in the 50s because the winds are going to pick up from the southeast and we'll have a few clouds. And then tomorrow there you see the 80s on the way. Very, very windy, but at least you have plenty of sunshine. There's also the chance to see the northern lights perhaps this weekend. Not a lot of cloud cover throughout the overnight time period, so might be worth a shot. Of course, there's a lot of uncertainty regarding uh, the northern lights. There always is, but the potential is there, so it could be a pretty decent show here over the weekend. Uh, grab your camera, check that out if you're interested. Otherwise, uh, here's your city by city forecast. It's uh, very up and down as we've been talking about. A lot of sunshine along the way and more sunshine for next week. We'll start the week off in the low 70s. We'll climb back to the mid 80s by Friday.